Hey everybody, it's Kitty Parade and the time has come for me to open up my Mospino Barbie exclusive dolls. If you haven't seen these yet, whoa, these are a little freaky and a little fabulous. Let me know what you think. Okay, here we go. It's this black box and on the bottom here in these beautiful bold colors it says Mospino and it's actually three-dimensional. It's Lucite letters. Let's see if you can see the thickness of them at all and they're just beautiful all right let's see on the back it says barbie moschino barbie and ken dolls moschino creative director jeremy scott dreams up another fabulous fashion moment all right are we ready for the big reveal right here it does say barbie collector gold label and barbie and voila so Ken is wearing this rainbow colored uh, tux with no shirt and Barbie has got a pretty outrageous outfit on too. Big graffiti letters here and it's even got initials like it's signed here. $200 for the two of them which is pretty pricey but he's so fabulous and he's so outrageous. I just think he's really something special. I'm ready to get him out and get a closer look. And the bottom of the base had this silver box in it. I'm guessing there's going to be a stand and some certificates of authenticity in here, maybe. There we've got our certificates. Moschino, it's just one, not for each doll. And it looks like doll stands. Okay, Ooh, that took a little bit of doing getting them out, uh, but I expected so because these are collector dolls. Many people just leave them looking pretty in the box and that box was a beautiful way to display it since it was pretty much just clear all the way around them. It was actually pretty ingenious the way they were tied in there. Pretty neato. Okay, <laughs> they're out. They're fabulous. Oh my gosh, what do you think of this couple? They're just too, too much. Okay, I'm gonna start with Barbie because I'm super excited about Ken. So <laughs> I'm gonna save him for last. Now, I don't know about you, but I feel like this Barbie has a little bit of a vintage vibe in her face and her makeup. And she looks like she's uh, been to the tanning salon or had a spray tan. And her hair is very silky and long and it's just slicked back. And then her dress, which is strapless, actually has clear little straps on here to hold it up, but that hopefully you don't see too much. She is not articulated at the elbows or wrists. She is in her fashion model pose here. And this dress, oh my gosh, this dress is amazing. Look at this color, hot pink, blue. There's a little alien face. Look at that, all the way down the back. Look at that, that's just outrageous. And then it's all hot pink underneath and then it goes down in this tight velvet pencil skirt. And then it's signed here at the bottom. What does it say? Moschino? something one Moschino not sure if you know let me know and then let's see her shoes oops whoa look at that pump that is a nice looking pump oh my gosh those would look great with some Mad Men Barbies <laughs> 
which are really beautiful. In fact, I'll put a link up to the Mad Men Barbies if you want to check those out. Amazing! I wonder if she has undergarments on. Sometimes these fancy ones do. Oh, look at snaps. Don't really see snaps anymore on Barbie unless it's the fancy stuff. Okay, nope. Oh, she's got plastic underneath and they do do that a lot so that the uh, dress, the fashions don't, the ink doesn't go on the doll body and discolor her. All right, so I think I'll just leave that for now since I don't want to discolor her and I really want to get to Ken. Wow, this velvet, it's a, just a beautiful quality. Now I noticed she doesn't have any jewelry on. It's just simple, it's all about the fashions and the shoes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get her on her stand, which is a clear stand, and then uh, there's a room for you to rest her legs in it, which is a really good design for a doll stand. I really like it. Let's try and slide this into her pencil skirt. It is a little stretchy, which is nice. I'll put her hand on her hip. You know, the Barbie and Ken fashions here are actually real outfits that were actually worn at an award show, and these are just miniature recreations, which I think is so cool. Like this is really Moschino culture. It just happens to be sized for Barbie. <laughs> okay, it's time for Ken. Look at him. He's looking so sassy. Look at that hair. I know this hairstyle is all the rage with that short on the side, long on top, slicked back. Oh, yeah. There is. <laughs> oh. There is a world of hairspray on this. It's almost like a little helmet, <laughs> a helmet of doll hair, which I like because I want it to stay like this and not get ruined. Now his head is interesting. It's on a ball socket, but it's at his chin line here, which is such a good spot to make the crease for the neck. Cause you can really give him a lot of expressions, especially since he's a male model looking fabulous. Okay, let's look down at his fashion. He does not have a shirt on. <laughs> and he, I'm one dying to know, is this cummerbund separate than the pants? It looks like it's sewn on there. And then he's got some pretty nice loafers on too. Down there. And this jacket is just beautiful. It's all lined. Let's see if we can get it off of here. Wow, he is a good looking doll. His I don't know if it's just me, but his arms <laughs> look really long. I'm not sure how in proportion. Very interesting. Oh, whoa, he stands on his own. That's kind of cool. He is so sassy. <laughs> All right, let's look. Oh, it has the Barbie tag. Barbie collector, it says. It should say Moschino. I feel like it should have a Moschino tag since it's an original fashion. It's all lined. It's absolutely beautiful. And I love this little detail. Look at the buttons. Individually sewn on there one at a time. There's four of them on each side. I mean, it's just a beautiful, beautiful coat. So here are his pants. He's got this cummerbund. Let's see what this comes off. Or is it sewn? It's sewn. It doesn't look like it has to be sewn, but I think I'm going to leave it sewn so it looks nice while I have it on display. And interesting, his pants do not fasten in the back. They fasten in the front. And oh wow, and his has a hook. I haven't seen that. Very interesting. Well, I love these. So again, he is like the model doll, the muse doll Ken, meaning he's not articulated. He just comes ready to model. Although his head really, I feel like you can create a lot of um, intent with his head. The way you can tilt his head it can mean a lot. All right, let me get him dressed up and we'll look at the couple again real quick. Again, he's pretty easy to uh, balance on his own. 
doesn't really need a stand, but he does come with a stand. Look at them. Are they fabulous? I think they're fabulous. All right, let's try his stand just because we can. It's got the black platform. And then very similar to hers, it, his legs are just gonna go inside there. Yep, there we go. Oh my gosh, I love them. Okay guys, let me know what do you think about Moschino, Barbie, and Ken, and be sure to subscribe for future videos. And bye for now.